Welcome to the Bell Plain Dollars for Scholars 2020 Awards presentation. This is Nicole Giesen and I am the current chapter president. Dollars for Scholars is a local volunteer run nonprofit organization whose mission is to support post-secondary education through scholarships. These awards are created through donated funds that are matched with monies raised from our annual fundraisers. More about our program and affiliation with Scholarship America can be found on our website. The web address will be at the end of the program. Since our inception in 1991, we have awarded over $1.8 million in scholarships to the graduating seniors of Belle Plaine High School. This year, DFS is proud to award 46 recipients with 146 scholarships totaling $77,100. I would like to thank our 716 club members, scholarship donors, fundraiser, community sponsors, and everyone who donated to our fundraisers. Your generosity makes our program possible and your ongoing financial support ensures its success for generations to come. A special thanks to our current board members and chapter volunteers who dedicate countless hours to make this all happen. Students who choose to participate in our program qualify for a scholarship by completing the required areas of the Dollars for Scholars application and meeting all required deadlines. The application consists of seven sections that include cumulative high school GPA, ACT or SAT scores, in and out of school activities, work experience, a goals and aspirations essay, and an optional recommendation and unusual circumstance essay. Applications are scored anonymously by a committee comprised of community members and Dollars for Scholars board members that do not have any graduating seniors. The earned scores are assigned a total award amount based on the number of participants and available funds raised that year. These total award amounts are then fulfilled by the various scholarships using preferred criteria set forth by the donors. The scholarship selection process is also completed anonymously, similar to our scoring procedures. Again, thank you to everyone that makes our program possible and to all involved in making another scholarship year a huge success. Students, congratulations on your achievements and best wishes on your future endeavors. Within 24 hours of this presentation being released, you will receive an email from us outlining important next steps. It will also contain your award certificates and instructions on how to accept and redeem your scholarships. Your scholarships need to be electronically accepted by June 1st at 11.59 p.m. from your Dollars for Scholars account or they will be forfeited. We recommend you do this as soon as you are notified, so keep checking your email. All students are expected to send a thank you card to the sponsor of your awarded scholarship. Their contact information is printed on the bottom of each certificate that we will be emailing to you. Now on to our program. Starting us off is Marcus Giesen, a 2016 Belle Plaine High School graduate and Dollars for Scholars recipient. Thank you, Marcus. We begin our program with this year's Outstanding Female and Male Senior Awards. These two awards are given to the students who had the highest scores on their Dollars for Scholars application. The Outstanding Senior Female Award in the amount of $1,000 is given by First National Bank of Minnesota. Our 2020 Outstanding Female recipient is Kimberly Teal. The Outstanding Senior Male Award in the amount of $1,000 is given by the Belle Plaine Rotary. This year's Outstanding Male is Zachary Olson. The Belle Plaine Education Association is awarding three scholarships for $600 each. These awards are given to a senior whose parent is a current member of the Belle Plaine Education Association or to a student who is pursuing a career in education. This year's scholarships go to Colton Kirkow, Joshua Gregory, and Amara Smith. Belle Plaine Knights of Columbus is awarding $1,000 scholarship to a student whose father or grandfather is a member of the Belle Plaine Knights of Columbus. This year's recipient is Connor Mulroy. The American Legion Auxiliary Unit 144 presents two $500 awards to a child or a grandchild of someone who is a member of the Belle Plaine American Legion Unit 144. This year's awards go to Avery Rapaz and Kylie Santovi. The American Legion Post 144 is presenting two $500 awards to the child or grandchild of someone who served in the U.S. military. These scholarships are awarded to Kimberly Teal and Benjamin Hudsader. 
The Belle Plaine Sons of the American Legion are proud to support a deserving graduate in their quest for higher education. This award goes to a child or grandchild of a person who served in the United States military. This year, they are awarding two graduates, and those $500 scholarships will go to Aiden Heidecker and Amara Smith. Belle Plaine VFW Post 6202 is presenting two $500 scholarships to students whose father or grandfather is a veteran of foreign war. This year's scholarships go to Morgan Kruger and Rachel Schmitz. The Belle Plaine VFW Auxiliary 6202 scholarship is awarded to a graduate who has a relative associated with the veterans of foreign wars. Their $400 scholarship goes to Michaela Koops. Three $500 awards sponsored by the Belle Plaine Lions will be presented to students who plan to further their post-secondary education. These awards go to Carter S., Trevor Gruen, and Zachary Olson. The Scott County Pork Producers award a $1,000 scholarship to a student who plans to pursue an agriculture-related career, who has been involved in FFA, or comes from a farming background. This year's recipient is Kara Wrights. Reruns, owned by Sandy and Dan Gardner, and Brenda and Dan Gardner, specializes in wholesale orders of all kinds, including banners, sweatshirts, trophies, medals, and a variety of sporting goods. This award is going to a student who has a strong music and athletic background that is ideally entering public relations, entertainment, or education. The $500 scholarship goes to Morgan Kruger. The Belle Plaine Chamber of Commerce has donated two $1,000 scholarships to help graduating seniors further the educations. These awards go to Kimberly Teal and Ainsley Bennett. The Belle Plaine Basketball Association scholarships are awarded to individuals who participated in youth traveling or varsity basketball programs, have volunteered for the Belle Plaine Basketball Association, and have had no history of academic or substance violations. The four $500 scholarships are awarded to Noah Schumacher, Joshua Gregory, Victoria Larson, and Ainsley Bennett. The Belle Plain Fire Department and the Belle Plain Fire Department Auxiliary are awarding scholarships to the child or stepchild of an active or retired Belle Plain fireman or to the students going into the area of law enforcement. The Belle Plain Fire Department is awarding their $600 scholarship to Vivian Herman and the Belle Plaine Fire Department Auxiliary is awarding two $600 scholarships to Kara Wrights and Carter S. The Canopy Group and AXA Advisors is pleased to be taking part in such an important community program and proud to be actively involved with our youth. The recipients of the four $500 scholarships are Victor Baltierez, Michaela Koops, Matthew Fink, and Dylan Kale. Cornerstone State Bank of Belle Plaine sponsors a $500 scholarship to encourage seniors to pursue a post-secondary education. Receiving their scholarship is Hannah Sklazacek. The Belle Plaine FFA Alumni Scholarships are awarded to Belle Plaine High School seniors who have been actively involved in the Belle Plaine FFA chapter. Two $250 scholarships are being awarded to Andrew Smith and Nolan Fahey. First National Bank of Minnesota, formerly the State Bank of Belle Plaine Leadership Scholarship, is given to a student showing outstanding leadership in his or her community and school. This $1,000 scholarship is awarded to Aiden Heidecker. The Belle Plaine Rotary Service Above Self $1,000 scholarship rewards a senior for their community involvement. This scholarship is awarded to Victoria Larson. Prairie Farm Supply sponsors a $1,000 scholarship for a student that comes from a farm background, participated in FFA, or is considering an agriculture-related career. This award goes to Cole Von Bank. Bolton & Mank Inc. is a civil engineering firm founded in St. Peter in 1949 by John Bolton and Martin Mank. The firm has provided municipal engineering services to many of the area communities since the mid-1950s. Bolton & Mank is offering a $1,000 scholarship to a Belle Plaine High School senior who plans to major in engineering. The recipient of this year's award is Derek Grangs. The Matt Sachs Chevrolet Buick Awards are funded by money raised through the annual car raffle fundraiser which has been sponsored by Matt Sachs Chevrolet Buick for the past 11 years. They will be awarding 15 scholarships this evening. The following students are receiving $100 scholarships. Brooke Adamitz, Benjamin Hunsader, Morgan Kruger, 
Madison McGrain, Kara Wrights, and Rachel Schmitz. Receiving a $200 scholarship are Jalen Struck Schmitz, Abby Brislin, Carter S., Matthew Fink, Joshua Gregory, McKenna Herman, Savannah Klein, and Danica Shinehouse Ganson. Receiving a $500 scholarship is Zachary Olson. Dennis Moriarty of Jasper's Moriarty and Wetherill, PA, is a Belle Plaine High School graduate and an active community member. Jasper's Moriarty and Wetherill, PA, awards a scholarship to a student with a 3.0 GPA or higher and is pursuing a post-secondary education. This $600 scholarship is being awarded to Michael Rich. Coburn's of Belle Plaine is awarding a $1,000 scholarship to a Coburn's employee or a child of an employee. This year's recipient is Muhammad Ni. Nee. The Pioneer Seed and Marion Tim Scholarship is given to someone who has selected agriculture, business, or science as an area of post-secondary study and has a 2.5 or higher GPA. This $500 scholarship will be awarded to Caitlin Holmbeck. The former Belle Plaine Kid Wrestling Scholarship is awarded to a senior who is an active participant in the Belle Plaine Kid Wrestling Program. The $500 scholarship goes to Derek Grings. The Ollie Heitkamp Outstanding Science Student Scholarship in the amount of $300 is given to one of the top five science students determined by the teachers of the Belle Plaine High School Science Department. This year's award goes to Zachary Olson. The Belle Plaine Youth Traveling Baseball Association is awarding two $500 scholarships to the students who have participated in the Traveling Youth Baseball Program. These scholarships are awarded to Colton Kirkow and Noah Schumacher. Brad's Barbershop Awards are sponsored by Brad and Sue Schultz, both graduates of Belle Plaine High School. Brad, the owner of Brad's Barbershop here in Belle Plaine for the past 38 years, and Sue, an employee of Minnesota Valley Electric, have raised three boys that have all graduated from Belle Plaine High School, and one of which returned to teach and coach here. Both are very supportive sports fans and would like these $500 awards to go to a three-sport athlete that has maintained a 2.5 GPA or higher. The recipients of these awards are McKenna Herman and Dylan Kale. The Vandermark Family Scholarship is funded by the Vandermark family to aid and encourage post-secondary students going into religious studies, science, or technology. They are awarding two $1,000 scholarships to Kylie Santovi and Derek Grangs, JD's Auto Service. This award is given to a senior that plans on going into the auto mechanic field or has taken an auto class during high school. This $250 scholarship is going to Nolan Fahey. The Belle Plaine Fast Pitch Association is awarding a $600 scholarship to a high school softball player that is pursuing post-secondary education. This award is being presented to Rachel Schmitz. The Kopp Family Foundation will be awarding nine scholarships this year to support the post-secondary plans of graduating seniors. The following students are receiving $100 scholarships. Nolan Fahey, Caitlin Holmbeck, and Michael Rich. Receiving a $200 scholarship are Dan Cooper, Victoria Larson, and Victor Baltires. Receiving $300 scholarships are Allison Dvorak and Dylan Kale. Lastly, Elizabeth Hilgers is receiving a $500 scholarship. The Scholarship America Mission Award is an additional scholarship this year created by Scholarship America and rotates to the different Dollars for Scholars chapters around their home office in St. Peter. The funds for this scholarship were raised by Scholarship America employees in its entirety with no matching funds from our chapter. Eligible students are high school seniors who have done community service and have a cumulative high school GPA of 2.5 or above. Each application for this scholarship was scored on the number of community service activities completed, total volunteering hours from 9th through 12th grade, and on an essay response describing their most significant volunteer activity and how their actions met a need of an organization or group they volunteered with. This extra $1,000 scholarship is being presented to Zachary Olson. We will now be presenting the 716 Club Awards. The 716 Club is an endowment fund designed to provide long-term financial resources to the organization. There are nine levels of sponsorship with awarded scholarships that are funded by the earned interest starting at $5,000 donation level. Some members choose to send in additional money each year to increase the dollar amount of their scholarship. 
If you would like to learn more about the 716 Club, please email us at bellplaindfs at gmail.com or contact one of the Dollars for Scholars board members listed at the beginning of the presentation. Information can also be found on our website at www.bellplainmn.dollarsforscholars.org. We will begin with our Scholar Level Awards. The Sierras Club, which stands for Service in Education, Recreation, Arts, and Science, is sponsoring a $100 scholarship to Morgan Kruger. The Belle Plaine Historical Society will present a $100 scholarship to Kimberly Teal. Belle Plaine Chiropractic is giving a $100 scholarship for a graduating senior pursuing an education in the health and medicine field. This year's recipient is McKenna Herman. The Belle Plaine Class of 1929 awards a $100 scholarship to a student pursuing post-secondary education. This award goes to Kylie Santovi. Marguerite Hessian Gatz and Robert Gatz graduated from Belle Plaine High School and are grateful for the education they received. Robert and Marguerite were encouraged by their parents and teachers to further their educations and for this reason feel blessed. Marguerite believes Harold Albright was a teacher who most influenced her life. This year, a $100 scholarship is awarded to a student pursuing a private school post-secondary education. This year's recipient is Elizabeth Hilgers. Minnesota Valley Electric Trust has established a scholarship to assist high school seniors in their post-secondary educations. This scholarship was money donated by the Minnesota Valley Electric Company patrons through the Roundup program. Receiving this scholarship is Kara Wrights. The Dr. John and Martha Bartholo Memorial Scholarship is given in honor of the former Belle Plaine Schools Superintendent, John Bartholo, and his wife Martha. This scholarship is intended to support a Belle Plaine student actively involved in the school and the community and is committed to furthering her or his education. This $100 scholarship is given to Abby Brislin. Next up are the 17 Club Heritage Level Scholarships at the $10,000 donation level. The Bell Plain Boro Riders Snowmobile Club is awarding a $200 scholarship to a student pursuing a career in environmental studies, natural resources, conservation, or agriculture. This award goes to Noah Schumacher. The Augusta Molman Memorial is presented each year to a student who has an interest in literature or has participated in music during high school and has a good academic record. This year's $200 award goes to Ainsley Bennett. Dr. Roger Hallgren has established the Roger and Shirley Hallgren Fund because the Hallgren family hopes to continue a legacy of helping young people achieve their goals through the scholarship. They sponsor two $1,100 scholarships that are being awarded to Dan Cooper and Savannah Klein. The Dan Dressen Memorial Scholarship is awarded to a senior who has excelled in both academics and athletics or school activities. Dan was a junior high principal and teacher here at Belle Plaine and a strong supporter of Dollars for Scholars. The $200 Dan Dressen Scholarship goes to Hannah Sklazacek. Sue and Ed Townsend and their family have been actively involved in Belle Plaine High School throughout the years, and Ed has extensively covered the events in the Belle Plaine Herald. This $200 scholarship is awarded to Muhammad Ni. The Friends of the Library have established a scholarship for someone interested in furthering their education in literature, library science, or education. The $200 scholarship is being awarded to Kylie Santovi. The Fintan O'Brien Memorial Scholarship was established by his brothers and sisters. Fintan lived on the O'Brien farm and cared for his elderly mother in rural Belle Plain. A $200 scholarship is awarded to a student who is majoring in the arts, science, or education. This scholarship goes to Amara Smith. Donald and Diane Kep are graduates of Belle Plaine, as are their three children, Deanna, Denise, and Daniel. They say, As a family, we feel we received a good education and enjoyed our years in the Belle Plaine school system. We also believe strongly in students advancing their education after high school. We are honored to give a scholarship to the student continuing their education. Their $600 scholarship is awarded to Benjamin Hunsader. Lastly are the 716 Club Excellence Level Scholarships, which start at the $30,000 donation level. The former Belle Plaine Ambulance Association is sponsoring two $500 awards to students planning a career in the medical field. This year's recipients are Michaela Coops and Madison McGrain. 
Our last group of awards are the Memorial Scholarships. Please see the Memorial Tributes section at the end of this program for a more detailed listing of each honored loved one. The Belle Plaine Class of 1959 Memorial Scholarship is given to a Belle Plaine graduate to encourage students to further their education. The Class of 1959 wants to give back to the community of Belle Plaine where they received their early education and to provide a memorial for all of their classmates who have died, specifically those who have passed since their most recent reunion. They will be awarding two scholarships this year. A $150 scholarship is awarded to Colton Kirkow and a $300 scholarship is awarded to Hannah Schwingler. The Andy Fogarty Memorial Scholarship was established by his family and friends. Andy was a 1987 graduate of Belle Plaine High School, active in sports, including football, wrestling, and baseball. After high school, Andy attended Mankato State and the College of St. Thomas before being employed by United Sugar in Chaska until he purchased Andy's Bar and Grill in 1995. The recipient of the scholarship is a student involved in wrestling or football. The student receiving the $500 scholarship is Matthew Fink. The Dave Westhoff Myler Memorial Scholarship was established in memory of David Westhoff, a 1973 graduate of Belle Plaine High School. He excelled in track, cross country, was active in FFA, and held the school records in the mile, three mile cross country race, pull ups, and sit ups. He graduated from Hennepin Votech in 1976 and remained an active runner, farmer, and bowler throughout his life. David's life was defined by family, farming, and fitness. This $500 scholarship is awarded to a student who participated in cross country and track. Connor Mulroy is the recipient of this year's award. Two $1,000 Kingsway Retirement Living Scholarships were established by an anonymous donor for students who are Kingsway employees, the child of an employee, or who are entering the healthcare field. This family's loved one lived at Kingsway where she received outstanding care. The donor hopes that others who work at Kingsway and or enter the healthcare field carry on the tradition of outstanding care their loved one received. These two awards are being given to Hannah Sklazacek and Allison Dvorak. The D.C. Townsend Memorial Scholarship is a $350 scholarship that was established by his family. The Townsend family has been a staple here in Belle Plaine, recording for many years. The family wishes that the award goes to a student planning to study journalism or who has been active on the yearbook staff. This year's recipient is Ainsley Bennett. The World Citizen Award was established as a memorial by the Mark Welter Foundation with the precedent that citizens of today's world share a common adventure in a common home, look for and share common solutions to better our world regardless of differing cultural and religious values. This year, the $1,000 scholarship is being awarded to Madison McGrain. The Marilyn O'Brien Memorial Scholarship was established by her husband, Kevin, and continues through the support of her family. Marilyn and Kevin raised eight children, all of who graduated from Belle Plaine High School. Marilyn encouraged her children to do what they loved. She was a tremendous supporter of post-secondary education and would welcome the chance to help further someone's goal of attaining that education. This scholarship will be given to a student athlete going into the medical field. The $1,000 scholarship is awarded to Elizabeth Hilgers. A new memorial established this year is the Kevin O'Brien Memorial Scholarship, supported by the O'Brien family. Kevin grew up on a farm in Belle Plaine and graduated from Belle Plaine High School. Kevin owned a successful HVAC business that serviced Belle Plaine and the surrounding towns. All eight of Kevin and Marilyn's children worked at that business in some form or another during their high school and college years and attended either technical colleges or universities. Ideally, the scholarship should be given to a student who has worked hard and is planning to attend a two-year college, vocational or technical program, or will be awarded to a strong athlete participating in multiple sports throughout school. The two $500 scholarships are being awarded to Garrett Boblett and Jalen Struck Schmitz. The Jerry Connolly Memorial was started by his family and the Belle Plaine Women's Softball League. They would like four $500 scholarships to go to softball and baseball players because Jerry loved the sport. Jerry played softball for many years before he started umping and he thoroughly enjoyed both. Men's softball and Belle Plaine went away for 10 years and Jerry and his son-in-law Brady helped to organize and get it started again about six years ago. Jerry worked for the city of Belle Plaine for 23 years but his favorite job was being a grandpa. 
Jerry is one who also loved being with family, friends, golfing, and making jokes. This year's awards go to Matthew Fink, Trevor Gruen, Rachel Schmitz, and Hannah Schwingler. The Jameson House is a federal nonprofit organization created to assist families following pregnancy, infant, and child loss through emotional and financial support. The goal of the Jameson House is to build a retreat-like facility where parents can stay following the loss of their child while receiving counseling and services to help them through their grief journey to a new normal. The Jameson House is again sponsoring three memorial scholarships this year. The Jameson Reed Steger Memorial Scholarship. Jameson Reed Steger was born on January 2, 2013 to Gabrielle Steger, a 2007 Belle Plaine High School graduate, and Richard Steger. He passed away in his home of SIDS on July 3, 2013 at six months of age. Following Jameson's unexpected death, the parents founded the Jameson House. This scholarship will be given to a student with a minimum 3.0 GPA and is pursuing a career in nursing, social work, or the medical field, and has participated in at least one extracurricular activity. The $500 award is being given to Elizabeth Hilgers. The Abigail Mail Adamick Memorial Scholarship was established by her parents, Corey and Ashley Adamick, a 2004 Belle Plaine High School graduate, after Abigail was delivered stillborn at 27 weeks. She was diagnosed with multi-cystic bilateral kidney dysplasia, a lethal fetal diagnosis at 20 weeks. Abby's loss catapulted Ashley's involvement with the Jameson House to new levels as Ashley and Corey now understood the pain of child loss. This award will be presented to a female student with a minimum 3.0 GPA and is pursuing a career in social work, therapy, or the medical field and has participated in at least one extracurricular activity. The $500 award is being given to Allison Dvorak. And lastly, with the Jameson House, the Talon Kramer Braun Memorial Scholarship. Talon Wade Kramer Braun was born on October 11, 2001 to parents Candy and Matt and passed away following a long battle with depression and mental health on August 2, 2018 at his home. Attending Belle Plaine High School, Talon was active in the fall play and choir he loved to sing, listen to music, write stories, play with his dog Opie, and bake banana bread. Although struggling with his own battles, he never ceased to put a smile on the faces of everyone around him. It is imperative to Talon's family that his legacy includes assisting others with mental health struggles and suicide prevention. If you or someone you know is experiencing mental health struggles, please know that suicide is not the answer. There are services, friends, family, and people to help you. This year, they are awarding a $1,000 scholarship to a student who participated in drama and speech and hopefully will continue participating in the fine arts after high school. This year's scholarship is being awarded to Michael Rich. The Mark McCall Art Memorial Scholarship. Mark was a 1986 graduate of Belle Plaine High School. Mark enjoyed art and used his talents to help create and design sets for school plays. Mark's interest was special effects makeup, and he traveled to California to learn more about special effects, which involved creating masks and prosthetics. A $300 award is being presented to a student who is participating in visual arts or planning a career in art education. This year's recipient is Aiden Heidecker. The Brian Grutzmacher Memorial and Class of 1982. Brian was a 1982 graduate from Belle Plaine High School who was diagnosed with cancer two weeks after graduation. Brian lost his battle with the disease two years later. This year's $1,000 scholarship is going to Vivian Herman, the daughter of a 1982 Belle Plaine graduate. The Marshall Gullickson Memorial Scholarship. Marshall was the founder of Creative Tool and Engineering and moved his business to Belle Plaine in 1971. Marshall thought it was important for young adults to become interested in manufacturing and created a mentorship program for high school students. His family established this award in his memory. The $600 scholarship presented each year is to a senior who plans to continue his or her post-secondary education in engineering, manufacturing, or a vocational career. This award is being given to Cole Von Bank. The Ashour Memorial Scholarship. This scholarship is one of our original scholarships established with Dollars for Scholars chapter and was started by email after his wife, Faith, passed away in 1988. Emil graduated from Belle Plaine High School. 
Email and Faith always valued education, and this scholarship is being given in honor of them to support any student pursuing post-secondary education. This $300 award is being presented to Morgan Kruger. The Marie Geronimi Shim Memorial Scholarship was established in her honor by her son and daughter-in-law, Lee and Janet Geronimi. Marie was involved in education most of her life as a teacher, an administrator, and as a lifelong learner. She believed that her students should receive the best education possible. There will be two seniors pursuing a career in business or engineering receiving $1,000 scholarships from this memorial. This year, the scholarship recipients are Caitlin Holmbeck and Joshua Yates, Maynard Harms Memorial. In 1958, Maynard Harms restarted the Agricultural Education Program in the FFA chapter in Belle Plaine, which had closed before the start of World War II. He lived his entire life helping promote and educate agriculture, whether it was in the classroom, the community, or at the county fair. Maynard enjoyed his career as he was able to help students find success in school and life. Many former students have created successful businesses and careers in the area. This award is sponsored by the Belle Plaine FFA alumni and presented to a student who has participated in FFA. In memory of Maynard, a $500 scholarship is being awarded to Andrew Smith. The Sean T. Biskins Memorial Scholarship Sean was a 1991 Belle Plaine graduate and a an very active wrestler. After graduation, Sean chose to serve in the U.S. Navy. He served for three and a half years and lost his life in an auto accident in 1994. This award is given to a wrestler who possesses the many outstanding qualities of Sean. The $650 award is being presented to Colton Kirkow. The Belle Plaine High School class of 1992 is pleased to present a memorial scholarship to a deserving student. Each of the three deceased 1992 classmates had great potential and would have been leaders in their communities. The students should be an active participant in extracurricular activities. This year's recipient of the $300 scholarship is Abby Brislin. The Belle Plain Cross Country Team's Who We Run For Scholarship is in memory of Tammy Fahey Schultz. The Belle Plain Cross Country Team's Who We Run For program encourages kids to use their abilities as a blessing to others. This year's scholarship is in memory of Tammy Fahey Schultz. Tammy was a runner and a 1987 graduate of Belle Plaine High School. Tammy enjoyed cheering the kids on at cross country meets to the finish. Most of our athletes knew Tammy as their teammate's mom, aunt, and as a courageous fighter of Huntington's disease. They looked forward to her waving out her window when she was able to watch practices at the Lutheran home. Athletes learned more about Tammy's courageous fight with HD through the Who We Run For program. Tammy lost her battle in December 2019, but her memory lives on. Cross-country athletes still run in her name. They run because she no longer could, and her memory is a source of strength as they dig deep through the pain and misery to the finish. They run for all who can't. In memory of Tammy, the $1,000 awards go to Benjamin Hunsader and McKenna Herman. The Wilmer Schmidt Memorial Scholarship is given in memory of Wilmer, an active community leader and longtime manager of Genesis, formerly the Belle Plaine Cooperative, now Ag Partners. This award is given to a senior who plans on continuing his or her education in an agricultural related field and who possesses leadership and the spirit of community service. This $600 award goes to Noah Schumacher. Anita Granzi Memorial is in an honor and memory of Anita by her husband, Earl, and daughters, Corinne and Michelle. Anita was a lifelong music educator who valued family, children, and adults. She worked as a piano teacher, choir director at St. John Lutheran Church, and also taught music lessons in the Belle Plaine schools from 1987 through 2003. Anita loved to sing. She toured Europe with the Augsburg College Choir while attending college. She received her BA in music education. This scholarship is awarded to a student pursuing music education or who is has participated in choir. The recipient of this $1,000 scholarship is Brooke Adamitz. The Blaha Foundation Awards. Gretel and Joe Blaha and brother Victor set up the Blaha Scholarship Program before Dollars for Scholars was established. The Blahas did not have any children, but having spent a lifetime in Belle Plaine, they had an opportunity to observe the children of friends of neighbors grow into fine adults. It was their wish that these children use whatever talents and abilities they gain as a result of this scholarship to serve the many needs of those who are less fortunate. This $400 award is given each year to a senior 
with good academic record as well as involvement in numerous school and community activities. This award goes to Zachary Olson. The Tom and Joanne Devine Memorial. Tom and Joanne Devine, both graduates of Belle Plaine High School, were huge supporters of Belle Plaine schools. In addition, Joanne was a longtime Belle Plaine Elementary kindergarten teacher. Tom and Joanne were lifelong members of the Belle Plaine community, and Joanne joined the Belle Plaine faculty in 1973, teaching kindergarten until her retirement in 1996. They loved children and believed in the potential of each and every one of them. They understood the power of education, and Joanne was a master at unlocking the magic of reading in the minds of young learners. However, she also believed in celebrating life and learning. With Tom forever at her side as a volunteer, Joanne helped establish and maintain traditions such as kindergarten field trips to downtown Minneapolis and the Children's Museum, breakfast with Santa, and the famous kindergarten Thanksgiving feast. Tom and Joanne loved their family, friends, and community. They gave so much of themselves to others, and the scholarship continues as their tradition of giving. The recipient of the $500 award should be a student who wishes to pursue a career in education. This award is being presented to Hannah Schwingler. The Janice Shaughnessy Fahey Memorial. Janice, a 1965 graduate of Belle Plaine High School, married Joe Fahey Jr. in 1967. Janice was very active in the family's auction business as well as raising and caring for their five children in Belle Plaine. She enjoyed attending wrestling meets, playing cards, and traveling. Janice lost her long battle with Huntington's disease in 2002. HD is a genetic degenerative brain and muscle disorder, which also took the lives of her father, sister, brother, and daughter. The recipient of this year's $500 scholarship is a student whose life has been affected by Huntington's disease or to a student going into the medical field. The scholarship is being awarded to Nolan Fahey. The James V. Nolan Memorial Scholarship Award is a $400 scholarship for a student pursuing a career in accounting or another business-related field. This scholarship is being given to Vivian Herman. Brad Carnitz Memorial. Brad Carnitz was a 1990 graduate of Belle Plaine High School. In high school, he was involved in a variety of activities, but his favorite was FFA. Brad held many offices both locally and regionally. As an adult, he enjoyed farming and the great outdoors. This $500 memorial scholarship is intended for a student choosing a career related to agriculture or natural resources. This award is being given to Avery Rapis. The Jerry and Mary Miller Memorial Scholarship. Jerry began teaching in Belle Plaine in 1951. He taught biology, health, and phi ed. He was a football, baseball, and basketball coach and was also the athletic director until his retirement in 1989. This award is presented annually to a student who has excelled in academics, athletics, and has been involved in a variety of extracurricular activities. This year's $1,200 scholarship goes to Abby Brislin. John Spanky Spellacy. John was a 1963 graduate of Belle Plaine High School. While in school, he was the student manager for many football, basketball, and baseball teams. Even though he did not play high school sports, it was his true passion. He worked at the high school from 1971 to 1995. During that time, he was an ardent supporter of all athletic teams. This year, a $600 scholarship is being awarded in a memorial to him to Danica Scheinhaus Ganson. Paula Olson Memorial. Paula was a devoted wife, loving mother, and cherished friend. The life of the party, entertaining and spending time with friends and family were prioritized. When she wasn't with her family or friends, Paula was sharing her love with others by making them beautiful at her salon. A hair therapy session with Paula cemented her as your stylist for life, and people drove from all distances to see her. We are thankful for every memory of Paula and will see her imprint around all of us. Whether you were lucky enough to have her help decorate your home, joined her at the salon, or hold an untold number of pictures on your phone with her, she left an impression around all of us. Paula's family would like the recipients of her scholarship to go to students attending a two-year or vocational trade program. The recipients of the $1,000 scholarships are Cole Brown and Kyla Taylor. The Katie Brislin Memorial Scholarship is awarding a $500 scholarship this year. Katie was a member of the class of 1992. She attended Vermilion College, majoring in water resources. 
She wanted to do something that would keep America beautiful. This award is given in her memory to a student who demonstrates strong academic achievement and plans to pursue a career in music or has been very active musically throughout high school. This year's recipient is Hannah Schwingler. The Julie Johnson Hallmeyer Memorial Scholarship is given to a senior female who has good academic record and has been involved in numerous activities. Julie was a 1980 graduate of Belle Plaine High School and valedictorian of her class. She was very active in sports, drama, musicals, and speech. Julie graduated from Concordia College in 1987 with honors. One year later, she passed away of heart failure onset by a history of an eating disorder. The $1,000 scholarship is being awarded to Brooke Adamitz. The Marjorie Jonathan Memorial Scholarship was established by the Jonathan family in memory of her dedication to education. Reflecting Marjorie's passion for educating Minnesota's youth, she began teaching in the Old Country School in southern Minnesota and eventually began to teach in Belle Plaine and remained there until her retirement. A $500 scholarship is awarded to a student pursuing a teaching career. This scholarship is being awarded to Joshua Gregory. The Deborah Newell Memorial was established by her Belle Plaine High School and college classmates. Deborah graduated from Belle Plaine High School in 1987 and St. Cloud State in 1992. She was working in Vienna, Virginia, where she was aspiring to become a Microsoft Certified Professional Systems Engineer when she became ill and died from a heart and muscle disease in 2000. The recipient of this $1,000 award is a student pursuing a career in the medical field. That recipient is Jalen Struck Schmitz. The Paul Kite Memorial. Paul was a 1951 graduate of Belle Plaine High School and a lifelong resident of Belle Plaine. Paul and his wife Pat raised three children who all graduated from here. He was the co-owner of Kite Motors for 35 years. Volunteerism was a very important part of his life, including 12 years on the school board, and was the recipient of Friends in Education Award in 2003. He was a member of the City Council, Chamber of Commerce, Belle Plaine Fire Department, Knights of Columbus, our Lady of the Prairie Church Council and Finance Committee, Century Club at Queen of Peace Hospital, and served as chairman of Barbecue Days for 13 years. This scholarship should be awarded to a student planning to attend a four-year college. This year, two $1,000 scholarships are being awarded to Trevor Gruen and Danica scheinhaus Ganson. The Dan Murphy Memorial Scholarship was established in memory of Dan Murphy, Dan grew up in rural Blakely, Minnesota, attending country school and Henderson High School. He entered the U.S. Army to serve his country before graduating. However, he obtained his GED following his return from the service. Dan and his wife, Mary Pat, raised their six children in Belle Plaine, in which education was always a very high priority to the family. Dan and Mary Pat moved to Kingsway Retirement Independent Living in 2010 as his Parkinson's illness progressed. With the services of home health care, he was able to enjoy his family and friends in his own home until he passed away in February of 2015 due to complications of his illness. This scholarship will serve as his family's wish to honor Dan. The recipient of the scholarship is intended for someone pursuing a degree in health care. This $500 award goes to Morgan Kruger. The Randall Cole Memorial Scholarship. Randall Cole was a very active person. He was a journeyman, electrician, and steward for the local IBEW 292 Union in Minneapolis for 38 years. Randy was a farmer of the land, cultivating his love of the land on his farm and rented acres just outside of Belle Plaine. The family was active in 4-H, FFA, and showing at the Scott County and Minnesota State Fair for 17 years. He served in various leadership roles on the Scott County and Minnesota State Pork Producers Associations. Minnesota Pork Board, and Scott County Farm Bureau. He would like to help students going into vocational or technical trade schools. He loved the farm and enjoyed the people he worked with. Randy passed away from pancreatic cancer in February of 2019. Randall's family is giving two $400 scholarships to students who are going into a vocational trade program or two-year school. This year's recipients are Cole Brown and Kyla Taylor. The David Carl Kipe Memorial was established in memory of David Kipe. David was a 2010 Belle Plaine High School graduate. This scholarship is awarded to a senior who practices at least one form of expression through the fine arts in or out of school, preferably a form of music. The student is one who has displayed educational ambition, 
maintained at least a 3.0 GPA, and intends to complete a four-plus year degree. In memory of David, this $500 scholarship is being awarded to Aiden Heidecker. This concludes our memorial awards. Students, the next steps for you. Please uh, make sure <clears throat> that you accept your scholarships through your Dollars for Scholars account by June 1st. Make sure to send your donor or sponsor a thank you note for their generous support. Their contact information will be printed on the certificates we will be emailing to you. And lastly, make sure to redeem your scholarships or request a deferment by the June 15th, 2021 deadline. Again, we will be sending out an email in the next couple days, so please continue to check and look for that information. We invite you to consider supporting our future graduating seniors through a sponsored scholarship by donating to the 716 Club or creating a memorial scholarship in honor of a loved one or friend. For more information, contact us at bellplaindfs at gmail.com or speak with any one of our board members listed. You may also visit our website to learn more about our organization or to make an online donation at www.bellplainmn.dollarsforscholars.org. In closing, we invite you to learn more about some of our honored loved ones through our memorial tribute.